Hi everybody, welcome and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. My name is Kubra, also known as It's Miss K. So today I'm going to be doing my last cash stuffing for the month of March. I'm just gonna jump right into today's video. I'm not gonna rumble a lot today, hopefully. And let's just go through this one swiftly, all right? So let me go ahead and grab my cash envelopes as well as my money. How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing well. Listen, the month is gone. March is coming to an end. It was such a weird month for me, truth be told. But Alhamdulillah, I'm so grateful that, you know, this month is ending pretty well. So let me put this away. So I kind of wanted to come on here and talk to y'all a little bit. Some of you might have watched my last video, which was our first. All right, so I did a brand new video. I'm just gonna go ahead and lay my bills down while I talk to you guys. So I did a brand new video, all right, and it was very different. All right, so quick note, I'll be stuffing $865 today. So as I was saying, I did a brand new video and it was something completely new that I did on YouTube. So I kind of tested an ASMR stuffing video on my channel. Uh, so it was a no talking video, okay? Simply because I actually already tested that on my TikTok and it was doing well. So I figured I would try it on my YouTube channel and see how people would respond to it. Okay. And, you know, when it comes to ASMR, I am aware that it's not something that everybody enjoys because, I mean, some people are very sensitive to certain type of sounds. But I'm the type of person, I love, I love ASMR. Like... I'm the type of person, I'm going to watch ASMR cooking shows, I'm going to watch ASMR mug bags, anything ASMR, anything that like tingles my ear glands, I'm for it, right? So like I was saying, I uploaded a video and um, someone mentioned that they didn't like my gulping sound and I don't know what else they said, but anyways, they were, they were not a fan of my video, right? I'm like, okay, whatever. <laughs> I mean, I don't expect everybody to be a fan of everything that I post, to be honest, I don't. Um, you know, but this is my channel and I am a huge advocate on doing whatever makes me happy. And I'm not going to lie, like filming that video was super appeasing to me and it was super relaxing. So if you're not into ASMR, don't watch it, you know, um, like it says it everywhere on my, on my description, on my title that it's an ASMR video. So if you're not into ASMR, not to be rude or anything, but like, of course, if a video says it's an ASMR video, you can expect some type of ASMR sounds. A lot of people that do ASMR, they expect the video to be centralized on sounds, right? But that being said, like, I loved filming that video, so I'm gonna keep filming them, you know? So if you don't like it, pero I like it. So don't watch it. That simple. Um, and the reason why I feel like I had to say that is simply because, like, I'm the type of person, like, I'm not gonna lie, if I don't like someone's content, I'm not gonna go there and spread negativity onto their platform right i don't believe in that i'm the type of person like even if i don't like something i will try and find something that i like and encourage that person because at the end of the day like unless you're on social media and you you are actually filming videos you don't know what it's like to be putting yourself out there and you know like sharing your content like us content creators like we know how it is to be filming videos and we know it's not easy right that being said I used to film makeup videos and I used to do a lot of vlogs that I know other people would enjoy and that I, to be honest, did not necessarily enjoy. So that's one of the reasons why I even stopped filming makeup videos. I'm like, okay, like I'm not even having fun with this anymore. So I told myself if I were to come back on YouTube, I would make sure that it would be by filming things that I appreciate and I enjoy to do, right? So if you come on my platform, I hope that you do like my content. And if you don't, that's okay. I respect your opinion. I'm a very simple person and I like my life to be simple, okay? So I said I wasn't gonna rumble, but this is me rambling. <laughs> All right, so yeah. Anyways, for those who did enjoy my ASMR video, this one was the first and I'm definitely going to film more because I like them. Let me go ahead and stuff my cash envelope. So personal is going to be getting 25. It's regular or it's usual $25. And let me know guys, let me know which setup you guys prefer. Let me know if you prefer this setup right here or the one that I had on 
my ASMR video in which my money was um, on a vertical layout, all right? So personal gets 25, and then groceries is going to be getting $60. Remember how I said I was going to be filming my keto journey, guys? Okay, so keto puts me in a weird mood, okay? For some reason, it puts me in a weird mood, and I don't like that. I did do keto for a bit, and then I stopped because I felt like with keto, I restrict myself a little bit too much. Although it is a way for me to lose weight fast. Like, I don't need to lose a lot of weight. I just want to tone up my body and stuff. But, um, sorry. Did I say miscellaneous? Miscellaneous is going to be getting $10. I decided to have a new approach in terms of the way I choose to live my life. Um, that being said, I am very mindful when it comes to what I put in my body. Or, I'm not gonna lie, I try to be because, you know, the relationship I have with food can be complicated sometimes. But, I try, alright? So, I guess it's going to get $60. Um, so, like I was saying, I decided to do keto and then I stopped like after a week and a half because I just didn't like the way it made me feel. So, I guess I won't be doing no keto vlog. So, if you're ever wondering why I always pick two ten dollar bills and two twenty dollar bills instead of like a fifty and a ten or like three twenty dollar bills it's simply because whenever i gas up it only takes thirty dollars for me to fill up my tank so i only fill up thirty dollars at a time so in order for me to make sure i don't really um get into contact with as many bills i make sure i have the exact change or i try to right so that's all for gas let me go ahead and put all these envelopes back into my wallet so keto is no longer something I have implemented in my lifestyle, but I do do low carbs. So I do watch how much carbs I eat, but I don't restrict myself as much as I used to because honestly, that simply leads, leads to me binge eating and that's literally the opposite of what I'm trying to aim for, right? So that's why I no longer want to do keto. Moving on to my sticking funds. Um, let's start with our sinking funds. With the month of March ending, Ramadan is around the corner. Alhamdulillah, I'm super excited. Um, for those who are not familiar with Ramadan, it is our holy fasting month in which we simply um, fast from dawn to sunset for a whole month. And yeah, so it is around the corner. As you guys can see, like this envelope is getting thick, thick, and I was saying like I was going to need a new one, but I don't want to get this one. I want something different, and I'm actually working on something. Therefore, I kind of need to be more patient. But I think that um, I think that the envelope that I have right now is going to be able to last me for a few more stuffings until I get the one that I want. So Sadaqa is going to be getting ten dollars. I actually did a mistake on my other video in which I stuffed 15 but it's ten dollars let's take out the tracker I like to update my tracker at the same time as well because oh my God, it just makes it easier for me and that way I don't need to go back and pull out my tracker and count to make sure that it is accurate so right now we added ten dollars that means we should have six seventy five dollars let me count this up quickly. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75. So perfect, $75. Let me go ahead and put in the date. I know I am a little bit late. I don't know what happened. I simply couldn't get around to filming. So I am like a week late for my cash stuffing. So I'm probably going to be dropping a new cash stuffing next, next week, depending on how things goes. But yeah, we shall see. I mean, better late than never. $75 is how much we have at the moment. Sometimes when the tracker is also updated while the cash stuffing is being done, it could take a little bit more time. All right, so setup is done. Now moving on to medical. Medical will be getting its usual $15. So that means we should have $90 as of today. 
I'm looking forward to getting some new contacts, guys. I'm low key tired of wearing, wearing glasses because, um, you know, like when you wear glasses, there's always a dent on the on the bridge of your nose, and I don't like that. So, medical should have ninety dollars, ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, sixty-five, seventy, seventy-five, eighty, eighty-five, ninety, and I'm also going to be switching out some bills, but I'm going to wait until I'm done filming. Um, how much I have saved in total for Q1. I've been looking forward to that video actually. I am looking forward to see how much I have been able to save. If you're not aware, this is my first year implementing the cash envelope system. So I feel like I'm, I'm a newbie in this. <sighs> so let's put medical back. And also if you can see, I switched up my nails. Honestly, I kind of miss um the mint but i also got tired of it i'm like that color was loud and i wanted something more neutral so i went ahead and i did this lovely pink so next we have emergency and emergency is going to be getting 25 dollars so a 20 and a five Ooh, stay put. um the sun is like coming and going so if you see that the light changes i apologize at this moment we should have 150 dollars let's go ahead and count it up 20 40 60 80 100 120 25 30 35 40 45 50 all right so definitely need to switch out some bills plus 25 dollars so Hold on, did I put my total? Nope. All right, so I have 150. I remember when I first started, I was a little bit intimidated because I'm like, oh my God, I'm starting from scratch. And I literally had nothing in my sinking funds. And I am happy I decided to simply push myself forward and start because I was, I was like a little bit intimidated with everybody on YouTube and like I could see how much they were able to save and then i'm like listen it took them months to save this much so you know if you're planning on starting just start and don't compare yourself to anyone just start and start with whatever you have you know that's a question that i always also get on tiktok like how do you start i don't have enough money to start honestly you can start with a dollar just start saving with whatever you have and keep building on top of whatever you save right next we have car maintenance Ooh. So current maintenance, oil change don't do anytime soon again. I mean, where do I go, to be honest? $15 is how much I'll be adding today. All right, so a regular 15. At this time, we should have $70. So 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90. Perfect, so $90. Plus fifteen dollars. Now we have ninety dollars. And you guys probably saw my Costco sinking fund. I received a letter the other day, and it was a reminder to renew my membership card, which I completely forgot about. And I don't know why, because I always see my Costco card in my wallet. But I guess that it's been in the back of my head. But now that I know I need to renew it by the month of May. I decided to simply do a quick envelope for this one so I can start saving for the membership fee and renewal. I'm not sure whether I'm going to be doing a tracker for this one simply because I'm not sure whether I want to keep this envelope in my binder or not. Um, okay, so Costco, the renewal fee is $63, but you know me, I'm about to round it up to $65. So I need to save $65 for it. So I'm going to be stuffing $25 today. I hope I'm not talking too fast. <laughs> Sometimes I catch myself talking too fast or someone tells me that I speak too fast and then, yeah, sorry. $25 is how much I'm going, going to be stuffing. Put this in. Like I said, I don't know if I'm going to be doing a tracker for it yet. I might keep it, I might not. That's why I didn't even go ahead and do a label. And I simply went ahead and put these uh, red rhinestones, which look cute, but I'm going to have to deal with this S because... It's definitely out of place. So Costco is all done. Business will be getting $20. Plus 
Ooh, okay, so if you did catch the March Madness closeout, I was able to save $145 during the month of March with the March Madness challenge, saving challenge. So I did add that to my envelope yesterday and I have $245 in my envelope, all right? And today we're going to be adding the regular $20. So I was able to literally more than double how much I had previously prior to the saving challenge. So at the moment, I should have $265. Let me go ahead and do a quick count. 20, 40, 60, 80, 120, 40, 60, 80, 200, and 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65. So 265 is correct. Put the date here, uh, plus $20. And we currently have $265. Okay, all right. All right, so this is definitely going to come in handy. I'm very excited. You know, there's nothing more rewarding than to save up for something and knowing that you have the money for it and simply use it up. I mean, the whole purpose of me doing these thank you funds is for me to use it up for whatever reason I am saving it for, right? So the business is all stuffed. Next, moving on to gifts. I'm going to be putting in, I think it's 15. Oh no, we're putting in $10 today because it was 15. Yeah, we're putting in $10 today. So whenever I have a total of $25 that I need to stop for the month, I always alternate between $15 and $10. Yeah, that's what I do. Okay. Plus. 10. So we should have 75. Let me make sure that's what we have. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75. Perfect. So we do have $75. Let me make, put this in now. Oops. $75 is our closing balance for gifts. Next we have Eid. And as I was saying at the beginning of the video, Ramadan is fast approaching. Therefore, today I'm going to be stuffing a little bit more than usual for Eid because right after Ramadan ends, inshallah, we have a Islamic celebration, which is called Eid. And yeah, I'm saving up for that. Now I can treat my family to something nice. Eid is going to be getting $20 today out of 20. So we should have, I guess, 75. So 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, perfect, 75. I would love to have $100 to spend for eat. So let me put in our balance. And I'm pretty sure inshallah I'll be able to get to my goal. Our tradition is to like, after going to the mosque, we usually come back home, cook with the family and stuff. And everybody lo loves eating those um Lebanese sweets so that's definitely one thing we all look forward to so that's it for Eid internet it is due oh next month so it's due on the 1st of April which means I'm going to be unstuffing this and paying the company and yeah so $25 is how much I'll be adding today for internet. So we should have $100 today. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, so $100. Put, wait, sorry, 25. Okay, so $100. Let me go ahead and put this back in. Sorry, upside down. So I am slowly catching up to everybody's video. I love watching you guys. I simply get caught up so much throughout the day. I love catching up to everybody's videos to see what you guys are uploading. And honestly, I love it. I love how beautiful this community is and to see how much we're growing, right? So yeah, I'm catching up to all your videos, y'all. 
all of them and i'm i make sure i'm watching to the end so that's what i do that's the thing like i don't like watching halfway so when i watch someone's video i watch to the end and i make sure i engage right so internet is all done that snowball is getting 25 dollars okay i can't wait to unstuff this one again and add to one of my debts so 20 45 50 is how much we have two dollars because we did pay our credit card last time so we are kind of starting at fresh so fifty dollars is our total right now okay and put this in all right all done with that snowball next we have self-care which i'm going to be using very soon because i have something planned come on now and yeah i'm going to be dipping into my self-care to take care of it i'll be adding fifty dollars so i haven't been rolling over any money for self-care or any money at all because i've been using it for my march madness savings challenge uh, but we'll see if i'll have any money to roll over this month so we currently have 50 100 150 200 250 270 and 290 so 290 dollars in my self-care envelope i keep telling y'all that this is one of my favorite envelopes to stuff and that's the truth so 290 okay let me put this in and i think we're almost done Ooh. all done with self-care and then rollover has nothing because like i said i have no money to roll over because i used it for my march saving challenges so we'll be skipping rollover next we have our 26 week 10k challenge and we'll be stuffing 385 dollars today after today's stuffing i am pretty sure i'm going to need a second 1k replacement slip so let me go ahead and see we previously had 1925 dollars in this envelope i'll be adding 385 dollars today and that would give us a total of 2310 dollars which means i'm definitely going to have to replace it with a replacement slip and you guys might see that in my next cash stuffing video so of course 300 that's the only reason why i pull out hundreds for the saving challenge and then 150 120 110 and 15 okay so let me add this up to the rest do we want to do a quick count sure let's do a quick count so let me put this here first and of course organize my bills because you already know Okay, perfect it's all organized so let's do a quick recap of how much we have right here we have a thousand right here a thousand one hundred two hundred three hundred four hundred five hundred six hundred seven hundred eight hundred nine hundred nine fifty a thousand so two thousand fifty hundred one fifty two hundred two twenty two forty two fifty one fifty two fifty two hundred two twenty two forty two sixty two seventy two eighty two ninety two ninety five three hundred three five three ten so two thousand three hundred and ten dollars so next time inshallah i'm going to be having another thousand dollar slip and i'll put the money into my bank so let me go ahead and update this tracker real quick Ooh, why are my threes always funky okay so plus 385 so right now i have 2310 we're like almost 25% there, y'all. Almost. Okay, let's put this in. Okay, and then we're not going to be stuffing the 2021 Cash and Challenge. We'll be doing that in my weekly cash stuffing videos for my money saving challenges. So skip that. And I'm going to be stuffing my buffer envelope. And for my buffer envelope, I'll be putting in whatever is left. So 50, 70, 80, 85. So 
So if you watch my ASMR video, um, I put in 80 and that's because I put in a $5 bill extra in one of my envelopes, but I, I did a mistake. So I'll be stuffing $85 and let me take out whatever is left here. So my buffer envelope, all right, when I was counting it, it seemed like more than usual. And that is because when I did my last um, cash stuffing for my saving challenges, I forgot that I had left money in here and i went out and pulled out some money that means i have some extra money in my buffer envelope i was only supposed to have 150 i mean 140 dollars but let's see hold on so i have 50 100 150 170 190 to 10 to 30 to 50 to 70 to 80 to 90 300 and 10 15 20 25 325 so let me see let me do a quick calculation i had some extra money that i had left for my saving challenges that i did not use because i forgot um, but anyways so let me just say that i added let's see let me put the date first so i'm gonna say that i added 185 so that way my balance matches to 325 so like i was saying um the extra hundred dollars was meant for my 52 week challenge which i'll be using and the buffer is just there for me to kind of use it as an extra if i were to need it for any of my saving challenges or my sticking funds yeah so that's it let me put the rest here and we are all done for this cash stuffing video i hope you had fun i hope you enjoyed um watching my stuffing video and thank you so much for everybody that takes the time as always to watch my content and honestly always supports me i really 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 truly appreciate every single one of you and as always i'll catch you in my next video until then stay blessed peace and love bye